Something that's been on my bucket list for a really long time that I haven't gotten around to until today is taking a ceramics class. So I'm headed on into the shop. Um, I'm planning to make my own plates, my own vases. I want to start my own line of kitchenware. <laughs> so let's see how this goes. Okay, Michelle, so when I was asking you about the background of this whole space, you were saying this space is very similar to a gym. Yes. <laughs> so can you please explain that to me? Yeah, so we offer similar things that a gym offers. Day passes, month memberships, and classes. So we provide the space, we provide the equipment, we provide the tools, and then we welcome people in to come use it however they want to use it. They can drop in, we're open six days out of the week, 10 to 5. Uh, they can come in whenever they want during those hours, they can call and reserve ahead of time, or they can just show up to see what's available. What are some of the things people can create when they come in? Or is it kind of like an open canvas for them? They can make whatever they want, pottery related. We don't provide any rules or any size or anything like that. It's usually functional in here, so it's tableware or cups or mugs or plates or whatnot. We have a couple sculptural things that always happen in here, which is fun, but yeah. they can make whatever they want. So then, in terms of classes, how does the class work? Is it group setting? Is it one-on-one -on -one if you really wanted that? We offer both. So we offer one-on-ones during the week. Uh, I teach them and uh, it's just the one person with me and we sort of get more of a focus learning that way. Uh, we also offer group classes different times, sometimes nights, sometimes mornings. Uh, we have eight wheels, so there's eight students, so it's nice and small. Yeah, and they can learn that way as well. And I think the one-on-one -on -one is really important, especially if you're now trying it, like me. <laughs> like I need well, some extra TLC, because I'm like, what am I doing? <laughs> it, it can be hard. I think as we're mainly an adult-based studio. As adults, we sometimes uh, get nervous learning new things. We don't want to fail. We don't want to not look as good as we want to be. Everyone always says it's so much harder than it looks. Yeah. After my first beginner's class, this is what I made. Made this with my two hands, it's my baby. Um, so it's gonna dry for about four days and they're gonna fire it for the first time. I can come back, glaze it, and then they'll fire it for the very last time. So that whole process takes like two to three weeks to complete it. Uh, then I could take it home, I can drink from it, I can put flowers in it, but most importantly, I'll be putting this online for sale. Bidding price starts at $20,000. If you want it, holla. If you don't want it, I'll keep it, I guess. 